Hi, my name is Eric Herman, and I'm the Director of Systems Engineering with JPS. And I'd like to talk to you about the ACU Z1. The ACU Z1 builds off of our legacy ACU 1000 2000 models, and that it offers a rack mount modular interoperability gateway, with the ACU Z1 being the next generation version. The ACU Z1 is smaller than its predecessors at only 2U and is also capable of handling 12 interface cards. Unlike its predecessors, it's also capable of handling a number of virtual IP channels as well. The ACU Z1 currently features two interface modules, a VIM Z1 and a PSTN Z1. The VIM or voice interface module is capable of being configured in a variety of different ways. It can function as a standard radio interface, any number of IP interfaces, or as a pass-through on the unit itself. All of the local resources available on the Z1 hardware, as well as any remote IP resources connected to it, will show up on your resource screen here on the left. Any number of these resources may be used in your interoperability system. They may be placed in nets. Any resource may function as the dispatch source, providing access to a number of other resources on the system. As the dispatch source, whichever resource is selected has the capability to monitor and select a specific number of channels. Placing a resource within an interoperability net is as simple as a drag and drop procedure. When the resource is placed into a net, other resources may be placed along with it. There are system dialog buttons as well, enabling users to connect and dial out to specific destinations. If a system operator wishes to disband the net or even delete it, those options are readily available. In addition to the integrated dispatch functionality, we have integrated recording functionality as well, allowing system operators the ability to configure and stream to IP recorders directly from the device itself. In addition to that, we have opened a portal to a milestone video server which allows us to view video streams in real time and serve as a true common operating platform. Once the server has been associated with your ACU Z1, you simply click on any of the cameras available and it opens it into a new window. Place right alongside your interoperability nets and your dispatch. You then have the option to expand this view To close this view, and even features embedded PTZ functionality. The first release of the ACU Z1 will be compatible with JPS's Waze Wide Area Interoperability software. This ensures that existing Waze customers have a clear migration plan between our legacy equipment in the new Z-centered wide area interoperability solution. The hardware modules within the ACU Z1 will be shown alongside resources from other JPS gateways and will be available for patching to any other resource within the shared system or the ACU Z1 itself. Resource monitoring is available as well through the Waze interface and is displayed on the common operating picture of the ACU Z1 providing yet another level of detail. We're excited to bring this new set of features into the ACU lineup. We're currently in the final stages of development, currently taking orders and expecting to ship soon.